came back and Eve is releasing a brand new song called Bokurano. And it's gonna be interesting. I was just working on my stuff and it's premiering, so we're gonna be checking out. Also, I just wanna thank you guys who have wished me welcome back in my previous video. That really means a lot to me. And I also hope that the Japanese translation is good, which also got me thinking, are you guys also learning Japanese with Japanese music? That makes me feel like maybe I should learn Japanese with Japanese music because that's actually how I learned English in the first place, which is through listening to Linkin Parks, a band that 1OK Rock loves. And Linkin Park is a band that came out during my time when I was a teenager. And that really helped me be able to speak how I'm speaking right now. Maybe I should learn Japanese with Japanese music. Let me know in the comment section down below how many of you guys are actually doing so. I do have a bit of Japanese vocabulary. You know what? Let's dive into the first part of Bokurano and let's learn a little bit. So the first part of this song is this. Of course, I know Shiro is white and Kuro is black. Sekai is world. So Shiro mo. Mo means also or even. So Shiro mo, Kuro mo. Nikushimi means hatred. That's a brand new word for me. Oh, Tachidomaru means to stop. So I guess that means now I can stop saying. Yamete. I heard Tada a lot. So Tada means just or only. Tada. Well, I guess so far the two biggest words that I learned over here is Tada, which is just only. I don't know. I don't know if I'll be able to remember the word Muko. You guys, at the start of the song, I guess it's gonna be a sad one. So let's dive in to Eve's latest song. Subscribe to this channel so that we can enjoy more Japanese music, and let's go. I always like it when they put that ha huh sound. Oh. I think I spoke too soon about this song being like, you know, slower pace. Wow. You can really hear the Japanese words that we just talked about. You gotta turn that up. Oh snap! Love the art by the way. It really has like... A lot of the classic things that we really like. The visuals and all. Oh! Wow. There's this positiveness that you can feel from this song. Also, I think the last part kind of reminds me a little bit of Hakujin, which is like a very nice feeling. I think this is the part that when you listen to this a lot of times, you really love and enjoy that smoothness, you know, that, that just a relaxing feeling to it. Why are there so many cut though? Ah. Man, the chorus slaps! You know, like, the characters and everything, the drawing is kind of rough, but the girl has a little bit of, like, a uh, much more detail to it, should I say? Oh! Wow, energy just shifted like that! Wow! Wow! I like how the energy is pumping, but you hear Eve singing, it's just like so... Reserve, you know, it's like so, 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 so held back. Zen Moon means everything. The core is really nice. And especially this part, it has a lot of like, you know. It's suddenly just half time. Everybody will just be jumping in a slower pace. Wow, the end wow, the ending just came like that. Very nice. Arrangement by Numa. 
I, I, I really like that. The touch of classiness that we know of Eve though. So, so in my reaction video now, I decided to listen to the songs two times because just listening to it one time doesn't quite do its justice. So let's go ahead and take a look at this for the second time. Let's see what we capture. I, I didn't manage to capture the detail about the whole blood thing and the suicidal storm. Yeah, what's with this whole blood thing? And each time when there's a blood, there's a person coming in? You know, who wouldn't like to... Who wouldn't like to stay in this kind of a uh, van? Is this a van that has like nature inside? It feels like so in and out, you get to see the cloud. Who wouldn't like that, right? You know this part when I was listening to it for the first time, I thought this was quite interesting to have a one-liner pre-chorus that appears only one time in the song I thought this was actually a chorus. I thought it's like, uh, oh, we're already into the chorus. But turns out, oh, turns out it's gonna be the next, the line that opens for the actual chorus, which suddenly now it came to my head. Oh, this is gonna be good. Here we go. Oh wait, one of the live person just poof? I like the part where this suddenly just slows down and I love the symphony. Really reminds me a lot with Hakujin though. I think this could be Eve's biggest hit in 2023 among those hardcore fans. Definitely not as strong as the previous one, as in like song to represent Eve, but this is one of those songs that you can feel like only Eve fans would really get into and really like because there's a lot of hints of uh, his sounds, his classic sounds. And the video too. Very nice, let's listen to that again. I love the harmonies, man. Try listen to the vocal harmonies one more time. I should I just fast forward two times. City goes boom! Really love the art. Amazing art. Oh. Oh, I love that. I love that change right there. Sinister. I really like this part. Amazing bridge. And then it picks up! Bong Oh, that's an old reference!
uh, Water Ground? Bokura no Underground? Is that what the title is? Seems to be? Wow, if this song is being played live, I can feel like, wow, the energy, probably, he might extend this whole part. Now, if you like this reaction, do support my channel. Go to patreon.com slash Japan, where you also get to vote for music. Recommend me music down here, subscribe, and check out this music reaction that you might be into. See you next time.